mic. Today I'm going to be talking about topic number two, a changing point in my life. Uh, the changing point in my life was basically what led me to come here and to be in this class. I started one of my main hobbies and my passion, now it's a hobby, no longer a passion, is singing and dancing. I've been singing since I was four. I've been dancing since I was six. And on November 22nd, 2011, I was in a finals talent show for the Middle East International Schools Committee, where a bunch of schools from all over the Middle East would be competing. I was basically uh, on behalf of Jordan singing. While I was singing a song by Michael Jackson called Billie Jean, um, yeah, I think we all know that song. <laughs> I sang an octave higher than my voice, so basically I tried to imitate Michael Jackson to an extreme extent, which uh, led me to have my strained voice, and after I won second place, I broke my leg. So basically, I had to cope with a broken leg and a strained voice, where I can't talk, I can't do anything, I can't even move, the pain is excruciating. They drove me straight to the hospital, to the RCSI hospital in Bahrain. Um, I stayed there for about a month. I couldn't move my leg completely for 60 days, and I could have partially moved it for another 30 days. My voice was strained for 18 months. So during those appointments, uh, and during the doctor's appointments, I uh, started having an interest in politics due to a book by President John F. Kennedy called Profiles in Courage, which is a bestseller in the Pulitzer Winter Prize. After I got the news from the doctor a month and a half later that I can't sing and I can't dance, my foot, actually, they had to remove a part of it and relocate it, a part of my knee, actually. Uh, I realized then that I needed a replacement as soon as possible to try to come up with a career. And uh, I started reading more and I started learning more about politics and about the presence of the United States and how great they are and what they've achieved. And I've been raised by this saying that my dad always told me since he was a Kennedy man too. Those who dare to fail miserably can achieve greatly. And I've learned from that maybe I might have failed in music, but hopefully I'll succeed in achieving politics. And that's why today, even though I'm not gonna be pursuing music for a career, but hopefully I would pursue a career in politics. And that's it, thank you very much. History channels the Kennedys. Yes. That's a good one. Yeah. Everything about Kennedy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm obsessed with them. Same. <laughs> yeah. Who's your favorite? Huh? Who's your favorite? My favorite Kennedy? Yeah. Jackie. She was badass. Yeah, she was. Like, she was <laughs> like you she know, low key, Jackie was telling him off every other day for being an asshole. Yes. <laughs> he was being an asshole. Look at that. I know. Dude, dude. Marilyn, Marilyn.